Welcome! Today we are going to make tomato basil soup. The ingredients include fresh basil, fresh tomatoes, a cup of whipping cream, salt and pepper for to taste. We also have some peeled tomatoes. We have butter, garlic, beef noodle for flavor. Bring some water into a boil. Make a nice bath in a large bowl. Slip that to the side. Slit your tomatoes at the bottom, making an X. This will help will, will help in peeling the tomato skin. Plunge the tomatoes into boiling water for 30 seconds or the tomato skin starts to peel off. After they start peeling, remove your tomatoes. Mass your tomatoes in a nice bath so that it will be easy to remove the skin. Let them sit in and cool for 5 minutes. Tomatoes have chilled. Remove them from the ice bath. Remove the skin, discarding it. Cut the tomatoes in half. And scoop out the seeds. Make sure you scoop out all the seeds. You've scooped out all the seeds. Cut your tomatoes lengthwise and into quarters Slice your garlic into small pieces. Put your garlic into a pasta. Once your garlic is fine, put it on a spoon awaiting to be prepared. In a large stock pot with medium heat, add the tomatoes. along with your four cups of peeled tomatoes. Also, at this level, add your garlic. Add your garlic. Add your garlic. Reduce the heat and simmer for 30 minutes. While the tomatoes cook, you can be preparing your basil. While, while the tomatoes cook, prepare your basil. Prepare your basil. At the end of 30 minutes, remove your stock pot from the heat, add fresh basil, use an immersion blender to mix,
it's now make sure that it's blended well with the parsley as you can see it's finely blend, blended together after it's blended add in your one cup of heavy whipping cream then you add a half a cup of butter you stir in while still heating season with a little pepper and a little salt to taste you can also season with beef knobs make sure you season with enough salt to taste then you can season with your beef knobs you can also use vegetable knobs or even chicken knobs as for your preference Don't let it boil. It, it's ready to eat and it's best eaten while it's warm. Thank you.